hello guys welcome to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to make coriander oil coriander oil is made from coriander seeds and has lots of benefits it helps with aches pains and skin concerns it has antiseptic antifungal and detoxifying properties it helps to soothe eczema fungal infections and allergic reaction on your skin it is a stimulating oil that helps to aid digestion you can use this to cook you can ingest it because coriander is a herb is a spice as well and it also helps to decrease pain so for this oil you're going to need some coriander seeds i have my dry coriander seeds that i got from the market and you use any oil of your choice i'm using almond oil but of course you can use olive oil coconut oil grapeseed oil any oil that you have available then i'm going to measure out my coriander seeds into my mortar i'm just going to crush it a bit so i can get all the benefits the aroma of the coriander seeds so coriander seeds are full of vitamin k which helps your blood clot when you are injured it helps to reduce inflammation and blood sugar as well it is rich in folic acid vitamin a and beta carotene which are all good for your body your hair skin and for ingesting so once i've crushed the coriander seeds I'm going to add it into my glass jar. And then I'm going to add my almond oil. Almond oil on its own is rich in vitamin E, which can help your hair and your skin. It is also a great moisturizer for dry skin. It is also very good for hair loss and dandruff. I'm just going to give this a thorough mix and I'm going to store this for about two to three weeks so the coriander seeds and the almond oil combine together marry each other it just infuses in, into each other so i'm just going to give it a shake and i'll keep it for about two to three weeks you can keep it for a short shorter period but i want it to infuse very well so this is my coriander oil after about three weeks and i'm just going to strain it so right now i just placed a strainer over my bowl and i'm going to separate the oil from the coriander seeds and i'm just going to give this about three minutes so all the oil can just drip into the bowl so because i use my mortar to crush the seeds you can see that there's a bit of crushed coriander seeds and the oil i'm just going to use my cheesecloth to remove any crushed seeds and you can see that the oil is very clear right now and i'm just going to transfer it into this container this oil can last for as long as the almond oil you're using to make this oil can last so it can last for up to a year or more and this is how my coriander oil is looking it smells amazing you can use it on your skin you can use it on your hair you can use it as a massage oil you can even use it to cook your meals it is very good thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment if you'll be trying this oil for yourself and for your family and you can also click the thanks button to support my channel to support the good work that i'm doing i'll see you in my next video bye